Yo guys, Spider here, and I got an update for you guys on the promotional images that we saw for the next map pack uprising. Here, uh, there's a user over on the Call of Duty forums, and I will link you to that forum thread in the description, who posted these promotional material images, and they are a much clearer view of each of the four map images for multiplayer as well as Mob of the Dead. So let's take a look at them one by one here. All right, first up is magma, and uh, it looks like we got a volcano in the background. We've got lava all over the place. I'm sure that uh, the lava is going to act as an obstacle, and unlike in uh, zombies, I'm pretty sure if you fall into the <laughs> into the lava on magma, you'll probably die. I know Treyarch likes to put in those. I mean, look at hydro. You go in the water. I mean, you can fall off the edge of the water, but then when the water runs, you're dead. I think, uh, yeah, you're going to have to watch and tread carefully when going across whatever is going to get you across this uh, this lava on magma. But it looks like a pretty cool map, a different map. We haven't seen a map like this in multiplayer. Next up is Encore, and it looks like it's called Encore because we're in a park where they're running a concert. It looks like that's a stage in the background. We've got lighting uh, on top of that stage area, and we have a light that's on the ground sort of to the, uh, to the left of the other guy. And this is one of the images that people thought, hey, that's a sniper rifle. It's got a, a bipod on it or whatever. But no, it's actually another guy in the background, and we can see him quite clearly now. Uh, it's definitely not not some unknown sniper rifle that uh, may be appearing here in uh, Black Ops 2. Now, I'm not a, a weapons expert. I don't, I don't I don't know if any of these weapons that you see in these images uh, may not exist in Black Ops 2, or if it's in fact an image or an indication of weapon DLC. I would probably say not. Um, and also, these images aren't actually in-game images. Okay, they're promo promotional images, so they may not accurately represent the map when released. All right, here's a nice clear view of Vertigo. Again, we got the helipad there. It looks very, very similar, although a little bit different than the Vertigo uh, Spec Ops mission from Modern Warfare 3. Really hard to say what else is on this map. I mean, all we have to go off of is the helicopter pad. We have the buildings in the distance, which, uh, you know, it's just a backdrop, right? So really not much more to go on here with Vertigo. And the last map is Studio. Again, supposedly a remake of Firing Range. Looks like, again, we're, we're, we're on set. We're on a Hollywood set. We've got a saloon in the background. And I just imagine it's going to be some sort of country and, and western theme. But the layout of the map is going to be, uh, if, it's, if it is in fact a remake of Firing Range, it's going to be the same sort of layout that we saw on Firing Range. And I think it's going to be similar to what they did probably with uh, Cliffside and Hazard, right? Cliffside from World at War, Hazard in uh, one of the map packs in uh, Black Ops 1. And I do like, I, you know, I do appreciate the fact that they're revamping the map. Uh, again, I made mention of this in the previous video about uh, what uh, Modern Warfare 3 did with Terminal. I mean, Terminal, they just touched up the colors. They really didn't change much, where I think this is just, you know, an entire reimagining of that firing range map. And last but not least, we have Mob of the Dead. Yes, that uh, sign is much more clear. We can see that it clearly says, uh, likely, United States Penitentiary, Alcatraz, one and a half miles. I put a, 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 the actual image of that sign from Alcatraz in a previous video, and it's identical. You see the guard tower in the far top right. Uh, it's very, very similar. Again, you know, you look at Call of the Dead, Mob of the Dead, it's sort of a similar uh, pattern, obviously, that we're seeing here, including that light tower. I would imagine possibly they're going to do the same thing with Pack-A-Punch with that light. Maybe, maybe not. Um, definitely looking forward to the Easter egg. I don't know. Uh, you know, it, it's zombies, right? I mean, they could tie this in however they want, or it could just be a standalone map. Maybe they'll tie in the old characters similarly to what they did with Call of the Dead. But if the description... Um, of the map is appropriate, and it is uh, the pro uh, Prohibition era, then we're going back to the 20s, 30s. Well, you know, Richthofen and, and all those guys didn't happen until later. So, uh, you know, zombies have red eyes. Like, who's in control? What's what's happening? Maybe there's, you know, a whole new backstory just for this map. Maybe this map is going to be even more epic than any of the other maps, more epic than Call of the Dead, and there's going to be more of a, a backdrop and a background 
for this map. And, uh, you know, again, I don't know if it's going to actually relate to the overall storyline that we've got going here in Black Ops 2 with our four new characters. And to be honest, I, I think the four new characters are, are compared to the uh, the old ones from uh, World at War and Black Ops and Richtofen and those guys, I mean, they're kind of boring. I, I really don't feel anything for them, whereas, you know, with each of the guys, except maybe Takio, uh, you know, I have, there's a connection there, right? And there's, there's a good backstory. They've developed those characters very, very well. Uh, We've only had a couple of maps to develop these new characters, but I just don't feel they've been developed the same as the original four were. But anyways, those are some updated images for you guys. Thought I'd get that out to you tonight. <sighs> I'm sure there's going to be a lot more coming, guys. Oh, yeah. Leading up to the 16th. Yes, Mob of the Dead, Uprising. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm Spider and I'm out. <laughs>